Hello guys, this is Harvey. Uh, sorry about the wind, but uh, I kind of had to find a good time to do some tuning and I uh, actually made a flight uh, on my uh, Tokyo 210, I guess it would be 220. This is the Stretch X version of the Tokyo. Um, I'm running the little whip antenna right now just because uh, I like it. It actually gets pretty good range with this thing and it's a lot less lighter, you know, a couple grams, whatever, for the antenna. Um, I'm running the T Motor F40 Pros. Um, I'm gonna have to get back a little bit because your head's pointing down. Um, and uh, it's run the Emax uh, Magnum Power Stack on it. So, uh, like I said, I have this is not exactly a maiden for it, but uh, there's some tuning that I've been having to do on this thing. Uh, to get it right but uh, I want to do a couple some good high speed passes and just a little bit of, around those trees over there um, but anyway uh, there's really nothing to it other than the run cam mini uh, on it um, it works well with that little TPU printed mount that uh, flight club sells and this is where I, where I picked her up from from flight club uh, big shout out to uh, Mike and them out there Say, uh, it's run the China Hobby uh, 100, the uh, 4S 100C uh, battery pack. Um, I was going to run 5S on it, but if you guys know anything that I don't before I strap a 5S, because I've got 5S in my bags, but um, you know, well, she, I know that I'm, I'm not real hard on 5S, but uh, maybe you guys might uh, know what some from the stories that. I've been hearing that you know don't that she don't take 5s on the Emac. So, uh, but you know everything takes 5s maybe once or twice and then it's gone. So uh, before I burn my brand new bird up, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, really quick, easy build. I would say that uh, it's a little bit harder than than uh, people say it is because uh, some things on that power stack don't exactly. Uh, I'm gonna say they don't exactly jive with the build. So you do have to do a little bit of modification, like that little, your one of your uh, screws that you use down there that keeps hitting one of those bets on the stack, on the ESC stack. Um, probably I shouldn't have even, maybe only used a couple, but I, I went ahead and used all four screws to hold the flight controller down. But uh, you can probably get away with, by not even hooking that up. I know Mike doesn't even use uh, four screws on the flight controller. So uh, anyway, I'm gonna give it a. A shot and see what she does. You set. And she is running on D shot 600. Um, like I say, you can read the specs on the uh, Emax Magnum. Um, it's all there. And like I said, the only thing I, that I did that I had to put on myself was the. Uh, the, uh, run cam mini and uh, other than that that's pretty much it so uh, it's already got that I'm running the I'm running free sky everything so it's already got a free sky receiver on it test would be for uh to try this out here in the wind to see what it handles so anyway here we go
two, drop. Drop, drop. Alrighty guys, that's it and uh, check me out on YouTube at Bandito FPB. Thanks.